Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to be opening the Cenoscorch pin collection and the Dub Wool V box. Um, I am going to be sharing the code cards throughout this as well, so I'm not going to withhold any of those. Uh, I won't be sharing any at the end of the video though, uh, because I did just post a video where I don't. Uh, solely shown code, so don't mind the Cenoscorch promo. It's pretty good. Definitely like it better than Eldegoss. Um, pin's pretty cool in this one too, I think. So there's the pin. Let me go ahead and focus. So there's the pin. Here is the promo. Pretty nice. Okay, I haven't had any luck with these so far. Uh, I've opened a couple three pack um, pin collection boxes and I haven't gotten anything, literally nothing. Not even a, uh, not even a regular ultra rare. So uh, let's go ahead and start with this one here, here is the code, since it doesn't matter, they're all white codes in this one, I'm not ruining anything. We'll go for the front. Alright, so we have Darkness Energy, the Choke, Beedrill, Arbok, Vulpix, Galarian Lanoon, Full Heal, Purloin, Kakuna, Sizzlipede, and a Zygarde. Zygarde is one of my favorite hollows from uh, the set, so that's okay. But yeah, I've not gotten anything still in any of these. I mean, I know that's just the first pack of this one, but I don't know. I'm going to open the Dreadnought last, because honestly, if I get anything in this one, I'm probably going to keep the Dreadnought closed. Just because I do like Dreadnought, and... Um, the rate these are going i think it'll be amazing if i pull anything one thing i don't understand is um is this seems a lot like dragon majesty i was just speaking to some people about uh dragon majesty and um dragon majesty was tough for pools in these three packs these three pack uh pin collections when they when they released those and I feel like this could be reminiscent of that. Um, but Kakuna, Rockruff, Vulpix, Sonya, and a professor's research. Jeez, oh man. These are rough. I'm gonna go I'm gonna keep the um, dreadnought closed for now. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the double. And if I don't get any if I do end up opening that dreadnought and I don't get anything, that's three pin collection boxes that will have yielded nothing uh not even not even an ultra regular ultra rare not not even you know no fool art no secret rare no regular ultra rare nothing so i'm gonna give up on those entirely and just chalk them up to being like dragon majesty because i wasted way too much money on dragon majesty buying those three pack pin collections um, but right now I'd have to say, yeah, the Elite Trainer Box is the place, uh, for the pools. So here is the Champion's Path Collection Double V code for you. Uh, let's go with Guard of War since there's two of them. There's that code. That one was backwards. Usually I don't think they're put that way, so I wonder what that means. And I apologize, I think I might have had my thumb over that one. So there's that, and just in case that one wasn't it that I just showed, I don't know. Um, but let's hope to get something good here. We have Trubbish. Nicket. Absol. That's, did I do the card trick wrong? Jeez, oh man. Marnie. What? I guess I did the card trick wrong. I don't know what I did. Marnie, all right, another Marnie. This is, see, that's, the, yeah, I don't know. All right, let's do all creamy here. Come on, give me something good. These are backwards. 
Maybe that's what threw me off. Being backwards. I don't know if I ever did the card trick. Alright, there's four of the fronts. I feel like I did, though. Psychic Energy, Machoke, Malamar, Hyper Potion, Ekans, Carvana, Pokeball, Potion, Rock Rough, Water Energy, and a Scrafty. Jeez, man. Alright, let's do a Guard of War. Champion's Path Code for you. For the front. Water Energy. Beatty. Team Yelgrunt. Cabu. Nicket. Galarian Lanoon. Potion. Trubbish. Roly Coley. Beatty. And a Hatterene. Wow. All right. So now which one are we going to open? I want to keep the Dreadnought closed most of all. So let's go ahead and try for, what is this, Obstagoon. Now I'm, I'm kind of, oh my gosh. I'm kind of demoralized, honestly. Just that, I mean, I, I don't know. I feel like the Elite Trainer boxes might just be like the hits. Because this is, this is pathetic. There's nothing in this. That's seven packs of nothing. And that means, wow. I don't mean to complain, but I've gotten three pin collections, a double V box, and I've gotten nothing. Not even a single ultra rare. Nothing from any of them. The only ultra rares I have are from my Elite Trainer box. After all that product. I mean, I know that's not a huge sample size, but when you think about that, that's, what, 13 packs, not even a single ultra rare? 13 packs, not a single ultra rare. That is, that's bad. Those are bad odds. Those are real bad odds. And meanwhile, in the Elite Trainer box, out of 10 packs, I got four ultra rares, one being a secret rare. Um, I don't know. So, yeah, I'm going to be over uh, Champion's Path for a little bit after that, considering I just spent a ton of money on the Elite Trainer boxes, and then uh, I've been getting nothing out of these products that they've released other than that. So, uh, But thanks for watching, guys. Sorry to be kind of a downer on this one, just kind of um, a little bit shocked that I haven't even pulled a single Ultra Rare out of any product aside from the ETB. So... All right, but good luck on your guys' pools. Hopefully you have a better result. I know I've cleared out some of the junk for you, so that always helps. But, uh, yeah, it, we'll see you in the next video.